Good evening, everybody. It's Beer ASMR. Tonight I have the Sword and Shield Vivid Voltage Elite Trainer Box to open. I've been looking forward to opening this one. I'm going to open all the packs for you guys tonight. Let's see what we can add to the collection. I have only opened single packs of these so far. Included in this box are eight Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Vivid Voltage Booster Packs, 65 card sleeves featuring Gigantamax Pikachu, 45 TCG Energy Cards, a player's guide to the Sword and Shield Vivid Voltage Expansion, 6 damage counter dice, 1 competition legal coin flip die, Two, sorry, that's this one. <laughs> Coin flip die. Maybe it is one of these. I don't know. Two acrylic condition markers. That's what I think these are. And a collector's box to hold everything with four dividers to keep it organized. I am looking forward to having the extra box space. Taking a look around the box. I am filming during the day today, so there might be some background noise coming from outside to get a lot of traffic on my street. I really appreciate the Pikachu art on this. Eh. Fat Pikachu. Oh, look, there's art inside of here too. I see Zerud. <laughs> Fat Pikachu. I guess Gigantamax Pikachu. I forgot the name of this. It's not Ori Beetle, is it? I don't know. And Celebi. That's pretty cool. Here we have the player's guide. Was that Orbeetle? No, it wasn't. Orbeetle V Max. Okay. <laughs> Alright, got the cards that we can find in the set. The rare cards and kind of like a whole checklist thing. Oh gosh, spoiler alerts. Spoiler alerts. I should have shown you guys what this looks like closed on the side. That is super cute. Same art on this side. This gives it its height. Cards. I won't bother taking these out of here. We've got the dividers. One, two, three, four. The sleeves. 
featuring Gigantamax Pikachu. I really like the colors in this. Very suited for the name of the expansion, Vivid Voltage. markers and last but not least the booster packs I'll put these in here some dice here to help us roll. This isn't <laughs> what's inside. I just stored these in here after I bought these other ones. Yeah. I've got a D8 in theme with the vivid voltage. I've got this very vivid lime green dice or die to help us roll to figure out which pack I will open first. Let's see what art we received on the packs. We've got one Celebi, Pikachu, another Pikachu, Lisa Rude, another Celebi, an Orbital, Pikachu, and another Zalut. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. energy and continuing with an aromatic energy swallow league staff slugma blitzel beldum a little beldum lost in the wood milsery which looks like a glove whooper Looks like we're walking in on Whooper. Oh, cool. I haven't seen this yet. Drone Rotom. Reverse Hollow. And a Regirock. Nice. I don't think I have this yet. I'm going to be setting aside the Hollows and the Reverse Hollows. So we can review them at the end. Next up is this Zerud pack. with an electric energy. Swoobat. This is really cute. Like he's probably leaving that island in um, Midnight Mass. 
Excadrill. Macargo. Taylo. Charmander. Oh, what a happy Charmander. Walking in on Hooper again. What is that here? Galarian Meowth. Cottony. Reverse Hollow Alchemy. Super cute. I can never remember the name of this Pokemon. Alchemy. Because I pulled a Rainbow Rare Alchemy VMAX, I think. Um, so that's in my collection, potentially from Vivid Voltage, I guess. I have to double check where it's from. Whoa! <laughs> nice! Here we go, Rainbow Rare Trainer Nessa. We've got a full art Rainbow Rare here, 196 out of 185. Second pack, let's go! Nice. Very cool. Alright, off to a strong start. Another Zerud pack. It's nice to find a rainbow rare already. Hopefully there's still some cool pulls. Two, three, four. Fire energy. Oh, I didn't move these over. Aromatic energy. Swallow. League staff again. Well, a few of these again. Woo bat. Oh, this is so cute. This is really sweet. Little woo bat. Sitting on a, a fence post, I guess? By the ocean. Maybe he's on a bridge or something, who knows? But he looks so hopeful about life. Yes, he does. About the wonderful life that he will live. Away from the island from Midnight Mass. <laughs> Tail. Charmander. Hooper, sorry, I keep walking in on you. Galarian Meow. A lot of repeats. And Reverse Hollow Ninkata. I might have this. I remember the art from this. And another full art trainer. Third pack, let's go of Alistair. This is number 175 of 185. This has got some really nice hollow to it. So cute. I'm very happy with this. This is a really cool bowl, just on top of all the other ones as well. Right. The fourth pack is a Pikachu. Starting off with a ground energy. A fighting energy. <laughs> I was just looking at the color, to be honest. Um, then I noticed the fist. A fighting type energy. Which is like, it's red on Pokemon Go, and this is like brownish, which is like the ground energy. <laughs> Alright, then we've got Trainer Carolus. Dusclops. Ooh, spooky. Opal. Chim Chimicho? Chimiko? Blitzel. Slugma. Beldum. Milsery. Moo Moo Cheese. <laughs> Reverse hollow Moo Moo Cheese. This is super charming. I think the items in the game are cute. Nice. This heals 30 damage from up to two of your Pokemon that have energy attached. 
Cheese does that in real life too. And we've got a holographic Dusk Noir. Cool. We got a Dusk Clops and a Dusk Noir here. Number 71 out of 185. Momo Cheese. Dusk Noir. All right, we're halfway through. Starting off with the dark energy. Swallow. Zebstrika. Dusclops. Arapuda. Ninkeda. Piggy Peck. Puchiana. Rockruff. Rockruff with a cutie fly on his paw. <laughs> Reverse Hollow Jolteon. Nice. I don't know if I have a Jolteon card yet. I'm not sure. I'm so happy about this. Very cool. And a two cannon. A rare, but not a hollow. been looking rainy all day today. I was hoping that it actually would rain for the video, but it didn't pan out. One, two, three, four. Dark energy. Giraffe rig. Alistair. The one that we got the full art of over here. Nessa, the one that we also got the rainbow hair of over here. Dusko, Dusko, Voltorb, Weedle. That's a very intimidating angle for Weedle. I think he looks much larger than I imagine he is. And this is the first card, number 001 out of 185. Then we've got Drillbur, a lovely Yukamori. <laughs> I really like this one in the fresh dirt. We've got a Clefairy, a Reverse Hollow C Dot, and a Xerneas, Holographic Xerneas. That's your standard Hollow. Such a cool looking Pokemon. It is very um, ethereal looking. Number 78 out of 185. Very pretty. Oof. Two more packs to go. They're both Celebi packs. Let's roll this one if we roll evens, this one if we roll odds. Odds. Giraffarig, Mumu Cheese, Ferrothorn, Pineco, Pinico, Pineco, Pineco makes the most sense, Clefairy, Dynamo, Milsery, Galarian Meow, a Wash Energy, Special Energy card. A lot of trainers and special energies and items I've seen from this set. And a Mudsdale. This reminds me of um, 
some of the horses from World of Warcraft in um, Battle for Azeroth. There's like an alliance area. Um, I forgot what it's called, but it's beautiful there. And there, um, it's humans reside over there. And there's some horses like this, or like this kind of shape. It reminds me of them. I was trying to form a mount there for a while, but I couldn't get it. Now onto the last pack. Goofy looking. Drone Rotom, Swoobat, Clampopus, <laughs> Skiddo, Shuppet. There's a lot of new ones here. Ferroseed, Joltek, a reverse hollow Galarian Meowth, and a Grapplocked. Alright, alright. Now, as a whole, I do think that the pulls were pretty solid. Can't complain with a full art trainer and a full art rainbow rare. I mean, I don't know that they're not in full art rainbow rares. Um, let's review the hot pulls. Got Galarian Meowth, Reverse Hollow Galarian Meowth, the Wash. Reverse Hollow Wash Energy, Holographic Xerneas, C Dot, Jolteon, Reverse Hollow Jolteon, Holographic Zuskmore, Reverse Hollow Moo Moo Cheese, Alistair, Full Art Trainer Card. I'll give you guys a longer look at these. Reverse Hollow Ninkata, a Rainbow Rare Trainer, Nessa. Nice. Reverse Hollow Alchemy, Reverse Hollow Drone Rotom, and Holographic Reggie Rock. I'm very satisfied with this, um, as well as some of the pulls from here, which I'll have to double check with the current collection that I have. Um, once I decide that I am done collecting or stop buying packs of a certain expansion, I will be moving them into a binder. Um, or, you know, actually for a Vivid Voltage and other expansions like Fusion Strike, I have so many cards I may as well buy them their own binders anyway. So I'll probably be doing something like that in the future. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you have a good, good night.